What's going on boys? Welcome back to some more Sideswipe. For my latest OP test, we have only done cars that I have gotten through the new Rocket Pass system in Season 7, but I forgot that there is usually cars in the item shop, and there just so happens to be two in the shop as of the making of this video. And those two cars are going to be the Breakout Type S and the Scarab. Both of these cars are painted. The Breakout is going to be in the shop a little bit longer than the Scarab is, so hopefully you guys were able to get it if you wanted it. But today we are going to be doing some OP tests on the Gray Breakout Type S. It has been a very long time since I tested this car. I want to say it was probably season one to two whenever it came out, maybe even pre-season. I'm not really too sure if it was that early, but I do know that it has been some time. But just to take a look at our ranks really quick, we're going to be jumping into each of these modes at least once. And then if we kind of struggle in one of them, we may try to make it up at the very end. Let's go ahead and get right into the first one. All right, starting it off with some good old 1v1s. As you guys already know, I am a fan of 1v1s. They're very good practice but I don't exactly like starting off with them because if you're not really warmed up and you go into 1v1s, your t uh, opponents are going to have a very easy time taking advantage of any kind of stakes you make. What a setup that was. It was a really cool one. I've not really had one like that before. And then I kind of just popped it up for him to take a quick shot on my net. Definitely not what you want to do. Gold Bouncer. Oh, that would have been so clean if we had actually gotten around him. Not really sure what kind of setup he was going for there, but we were definitely able to sneak that one in because his momentum was not what it should have been to be able to get up in time for it. There's a quick one. He's, he has an aftershock as well. We just did a... Oh my goodness, I thought I was going to be able to pop that up higher. I just kind of floated it straight in. Alrighty, so that probably wasn't the cleanest option I could have taken there. A little bit embarrassing even. If we can stay with this. I wanted to horse it as soon as he like jumped into it. Not sure where he's going to go with this. We'll pop it fast. Oh, he popped it even faster. He's going to be able to finish. He had enough boost to finish that. I definitely did not expect all that. I thought I'd be able to go way faster than he was there and beat him, but that was not the case at all. I need to get way back down because I have no boost. Is that going to be in? Okay, we were able to get to that, but now we're going to be floating down for a bit while he had enough time to get some boost back. See if we can make him do something here. We went for that last second gold shot. That thing, is, that thing was very clean. Almost got the fake around him, I thought. And to flip up to the... Oh, it would have been so much better if I'd actually gotten my uh, reset back there. Did that low pinch that we sometimes do on the backboard. Eight them out. Let's go, boys. We should be able to float that straight in. I thought I put too much power on it, but we put just enough. So far, this car is feeling pretty decent. Definitely not my favorite overall. Ooh, if I would have scored that, probably would have taken it back. It seems that he just kind of stayed right where my shot was about to go. And I have absolutely no clue how we just got that one in there. I kind of just blindly flipped at it. Let's do a bit of a fake here. I probably went a little bit too early, honestly. I would have flipped faster. Yeah, that's going to be an easy goal to finish. Yeah, if I had flipped a little bit faster there, we could have got that around him. But I just waited way too long for it. It seems that he does the same kickoff each time. There's always like a gold shot at some point in it. I don't know why I tried to gold there. That would not have been an ideal move. Tried to gold it around. I'm going to see if we can do that little, like, uh, baby manual flip. Probably could have done something there. Oh. Oh, that's just going to be an easy floater straight in there. All oh, these 50-50s have gone so bad for me. All right, there is time to go ahead and get it back. It's going to be very difficult, though. Oh, never mind. He did the fake kickoff as well, but he did it a little bit too far away, so we had plenty of time to kind of get back to the ball. I think he used his flip, did he? Oh, what a wasted opportunity, boys. I could have just stayed with that for so long since I knew he used his flip and he just waited out his boost usage. Oh, the uncle. Oh, let's go. I had to focus up for that one big time. We got the purple angle in there to finish it out. That was a wild game one. I'm very glad we came out on top in the end. He was definitely a very mechanical opponent, but I guess the breakout was ready for it. Go ahead and get right into the next one. Alrighty, looks like it's time for a bit of 2v2s. We somehow managed to sneak that win out in ones. Hopefully twos is going to be a little bit cleaner. I go load this. We'll take our time with it. Force it right into his face. Never mind. I guess we aren't taking our time with anything. Ooh. We can take our time with this one though. His teammate should be kind of low boost. We'll 50 50 this, get some boost back. Still staying with it. Made him use his flip. Should give teammate a little bit of a, like a pressure break. And my bad, whoever just dropped the sub there. I can't call your name out because I don't have my little preview on to be able to see the screen. But I absolutely appreciate that. And speaking of that, I'm actually glad that that went through when it did. We are getting so insanely close to 40k. I cannot thank you guys enough for sticking with me for this long. We've been going with Sideswipe stuff for over a year now, which is just absolutely wild. Can't believe the game's already been out for this long. And so many of you guys have stuck around since the very beginning, so, which is an insanely cool thing. I absolutely appreciate each and every one of you that have. 
Oh, I'm glad we held on to our flip for so long. A little bit dangerous right now with uh, how far up I was there. Kind of worked out though. Teammate had it locked down. Not sure what's going to happen here. I got very scared. Try to pop that to ourselves. All right, we came out on top there. I could have definitely ended up with a uh, own goal situation. Oh, I passed that right to him. Please bounce bad. Okay, nice. A teammate was able to get back way before they were. I knew he was going to fall on it. and I wanted to jump originally, but I had a feeling he was going to try to fall and pinch it. That pops up enough. Oh, my bad, man. I think he had some kind of setup going on there, and I just hit it away from him. Just jumping in, like, the line of sight that he could have possibly took. Pull back down. Oh, oh no. Oh, no. He peeked. Oh, that was... Oh, I should have been back in time for that one. I was so slow getting back. With eight seconds left as well, he absolutely came... Oh, my goodness. Oh, my goodness, boys. Oh, no. Oh, I just don't even know what to say about that. That slight little mistouch, and that was all that we needed to, like, hit the worst on goal I've ever hit. Teammate was pre-jumping. Oh. Oh my goodness, boys. I am blaming the car solely for that one. I don't even want to use it for the 3v3 match. Alrighty, boys. I'm not even queuing up 3v3s, actually. We have got to make up for that absolutely horrible 2v2 match that we just did. Let's go ahead and get right into it. Alrighty, boys. We are going to be doing absolutely zero own goals this game. I can't believe we went the whole match on the last one with nothing going wrong. And then eight seconds left, they get an absolute banger goal to score it or to tie it up, and then I hit a little own goal to like give them the lead. Definitely not what we like to see, but we're going to be getting that right back. Oh, the purple save. Let's go. Was it so hard to time? I'm always afraid I'm going to like shoot it right into our nut. Go above him with this one. Flip back down to this one really fast. Horse it in there. Oh, that was not the horse that we were hoping for. Oh, no. I think teammate does not have much boost. He had enough to actually... Oh, my. He had the gold shot as well. Okay, pretty clean. We can stay with this. And we did. Probably back to teammate. Oh. Oh, we had the passing play setting up, but they were just ready for it. Oh my goodness. What did he just do there? He dropped a calculated, so I'm I'm going to assume that he maybe didn't mean to do that. That was very sick, though. He knows about the go up signal. He jumped pretty high right off the bat. Or maybe they were doing one on their own, honestly. Oh, let's go. What a placement. Wizard is absolutely popping. Oh my, I don't even know what to say. I can't even get out, I can't even get my compliments out without him scoring again. He just scores instantly off of kickoff. I've noticed a lot of people doing those kickoffs where it's like a gold shot right after they do the kickoff. So I'm gonna have to look into that and try to get one going myself. Not able to sneak that in, unfortunately, though. Don't want to flip into that. Nice save. He has a flip as well. I think he tried to go for a gold shot. And I got too much power on it. Oh my. Not my cleanest game. I'm very glad Wizard's on my team at the moment. If we can get this around him, we were able to. If I hadn't flipped down so hard, probably could have got that in. I don't even know how that 50-50 ended up going back to their side and over ours. Almost got another gold sneak. He is just insane with them. And the forfeit. They didn't want him to hit any more shots on him. I don't really think I helped much at all. Wizard had pretty much all of our goals and a lot of our defense as well, I think. But he carried us to level 35 and we got that rough one back from last game. Alrighty, boys, that is going to go ahead and do it for this breakout testing video. We didn't do any threes, but ones and twos were kind of OK. I would definitely not recommend taking this car into 2v2 at all. It is pretty decent in ones, but if you take it into twos, you are very likely to hit some own goals. But if you guys did enjoy this video and would like to see more like it, please be sure to drop a like and maybe even a sub. And I will talk to you all in the next one. See you, boys.